clarify your position on the efficacy of hydroxychloroquine after you retweeted a video uh, making claims that it well, is was, effective? I wasn't making claims. The, the recommendations of many other people, people including doctors, uh, many doctors think it is extremely successful, the hydroxychloroquine, uh, coupled with the zinc and perhaps the zithromycin. But uh, many doctors think it's extremely good, and some people don't. Some people, I think, it's become very political. Uh, I happen to believe in it. I would take it. I, as you know, I took it for a 14-day period, uh, and uh, I'm here, right? I'm here. Uh, I happen to think it's uh, it works in the early stages. I think frontline medical people believe that too. Some, many. And so we'll take a look at it. But the one thing we know, it's been out for a long time, that particular formula, and that's what essentially what it is, the pill. And uh, it's been for malaria, lupus, and other things. Uh, it uh, It's safe. It doesn't cause problems. I had no problem. I had absolutely no problem. Felt no different. Didn't feel good, bad, or indifferent. I, and I tested, as you know. It didn't, it didn't get me, and it's not going to... Uh, hopefully hurt anybody. So we know from that standpoint, because it's been so many years, from a safety standpoint, it's safe. I happen to think, based on what I've read, I've read a lot about hydroxy. Uh, I happen to think that it has an impact, especially at the early years. There were some very good tests at uh, Ford, and the doctor from Yale came up with a very, very strong testament to it. There was a group of doctors yesterday, a large group that were put on the internet, and for some reason the internet wanted to take them down and uh, took them off. I guess Twitter took them off, and I think Facebook took them off. I don't know why. I think they're very respected doctors. Uh, there was a, a woman who was spectacular in her statements about it, uh, that she's had tremendous success with it. And they took her, they took her voice off. I don't know why they took her off, but they took her off. Maybe they had a good reason, maybe they didn't, I don't know. I the woman that you said is a great doctor, in that video that you retweeted last night, said that masks don't work and there is a cure for COVID-19, both of which health experts say is not true. She's also made videos saying that doctors make medicine using DNA from aliens and that they're trying to create a vaccine to make you immune from becoming religious. Well, maybe, it's so, sign, maybe it's not, but I, I, can't, I can tell you this. She was on air along with many other doctors. They were big fans of hydroxychloroquine. And I thought she was very impressive in the sense that from where she came, I don't know which country she comes from, but she said that she's had tremendous success with hundreds of different patients. And I thought her voice was an important voice, but I know nothing about her. Last week, well, real quick, last week you okay. said Thank you very much, everybody. Thank you. Thank you.